Well folks, welcome to your really detailed walkthrough tour here at number 7 of 18 Maclay Street in Turner, a development called Allura, which is a really boutique development. The unit we're going to show you is right up there on the top floor. A really fabulous one bedroom unit with a huge multi-purpose uh, uh, space for you, whether you're going to use it as a home office or study, you're going to see that very shortly. We're going to take you through every aspect of it on this tour, so stick with me. Okay, great, come on in, welcome inside. We're gonna give you a full internal tour now. Uh, you'll see there's an intercom there for guests, so uh, you don't have to leave your unit to buzz them through. I'm going to show you an aspect of this unit that really takes it to the next level. Although it is a one bedroom, it's got this huge multi-purpose space. So go right in and have a look at it. Shelves at the back, such a great spot for study. Uh, you could even be a little bit cheeky and put a, uh, a mattress down here and uh, for guests they've got a little place to stay over. Um, and the fact that you can completely shut this door off, go ahead of me now and turn around again so have a look at it. The fact that you can just shut that door off and have it completely separate from the rest of the unit, I think is a really nice point. Okay, so while we're here, we're gonna show you the bifold doors opening into the laundry. Oops, so you've both got uh, a washing machine and a dryer that actually comes included for the sale and a corner tub with storage underneath. Right next door to that, you've got sliding doors here. All right, have a look at this side, and I'll open up this as well. So linen, coat, closet, whatever you prefer. You can never have enough storage. That's your fuse box in case you're wondering what that is, by the way. So you can flick all the fuses off in the unit. And then have a look at this big open plan living space. So you've got a dining area, couch and lounging area, and uh, maybe a TV on that wall. How you set it up is up to you. We've got a wall mounted reverse cycle air conditioning unit, we've got that going for you now. So that's going to give you both heating and cooling. Let's spin around and have a look at this storage space. Again behind bifold doors, there's adjustable metal shelving to give you lots of extra storage. This is all carpeted and the carpet then flows through into the main bedroom. And I really love the size of this room. If you have a look at it, it would easily house a king size bed. It's nice and light and bright. We've got a window there, um, and lots of space for extra furniture items, but also an entire wall of built-in robes. So hanging space, shelving space. Open this one up for you, more hanging space and on this side as well, hanging on the shelf. So that should be very exciting for you. The unit has been fully repainted for you throughout, so all of that's done. We're gonna turn left as we come out of the uh, main bedroom, come into the bathroom. Um, so let's have a look at the corner shower there. You've got the toilet right next door. Uh, you've also got your custom vanity with stone bench top and storage under, and also uh, IXL Tastic heat lamps and a frosted external window for ventilation. Okay, back into this living area, and we're now going to take and show you the kitchen setup. So if you have a look here, uh, you've got first of all pantry space with the microwave that slots in the middle, fridge space right next door, and then moving along we've got our range hood over the top of a four burner electric cooktop, that's a melee appliance, and a stainless steel underbench oven, also melee. And then you've got your one and a half bowl sink and the window which looks out over McClay Street. I'm going to show you that soon from the, uh, from the balcony. And these bench tops, a nice big prep area, a spot where you can sit, uh, have breakfast if you like. Um, but stone benches, so really good quality finish. And then let's have a look at how the sliding door takes us out onto the paved terrace. And I'm going to give you a bit of a feel for just the elevation and outlook into the trees. Um, very soon they're all going to be full of leaves, that gives you more privacy. You can actually sort of sneakily look back through the Black Mountain Tower from there. We're right on the top floor of this Allura development, uh, so that's three stories out of three. So if you spin the camera around, you'll see there's nothing above you except roof. All right, so that's nice that there's no one above you. And of course, no one to the side. So we're actually set right up the top of this building. There's only two units that share it. Um, and so you really only have one shared wall with the unit next door. We've got your um, uh, condenser unit for the reverse cycle air conditioning. And on the wall, that's a Rinite Infinity Gas hot water system for instantaneous and continuous hot water. Okay, that's the internal tour. Come with me to the basement. So we're down here in the basement just to show you your allocated car spot. So number seven spot is right at the end so you uh, don't have neighbours on either side. There's only one level of car parking for this development because it's a very boutique development of course with only eight units. And this is your entry, so it's a remote controlled entry gate. And then just behind the fire hose wheel there, you get a single allocated enclosure with a lockable door for any miscellaneous items you want to keep outside of the unit. So there you go folks, that's the uh, tour for you. We're just in the rear of the development at the moment to show you the uh, common areas in the grounds. So really nicely planted out here. But the unit itself, top floor, 
vacant, ready for you, immediately so close to the city, yet absolutely quiet. There's no big traffic noise and everything around here. And I really like these boutique developments, they're nice and small. With only eight units like this are really hard to come by. So I hope you love it as much as we do, and I hope we see you at one of the next openings.